At the moment, the environment around here, which is known as the Severn Vale, is very much dictated by the tidal nature of this river. Before the barrage was built on the river rants in Brittany, upstream of the estuary is said to have been abundant with marine life. But post-barrage, was this and is this still the case? After 40 years of, um, of producing electricity, the conclusion is that uh, there is a, a very light uh, effect on the environment. Director at EDF Energy, Cyril Perrier. The fish population in the estuary is uh, almost um, is better than the population of uh, fish we can find in estuary uh, which uh, have no uh, tidal power station. Uh, in the dam we have six uh, gates which are quite high, uh, about uh, 50 meters uh, 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 wide. So uh, all the fish can go uh, from uh, the sea to the estuary and in the other way. Other concerns include how a Severn barrage will affect marine bird life in the estuary and upstream. Being the home to the Wildfowl and Wetlands Trust, the conservation of many species which flock to the centre are high on the priority list. Director of the Wildfowl and Wetlands Trust at Slimbridge is Martin Spray. It's quite unique in having a, a very large tidal range, uh, the second largest in the world, believe it or not and uh, that actually has quite an impact on the exposure of the, the mud and the maintenance of the salt marsh here on the Severn. And that's very, very important, particularly for overwintering waterbirds. Uh, waders such as redshank, snipe, curlew come here in their tens of thousands. Very, very important. So the Severn barrage um, would, would have inevitably a major impact on that tidal range and therefore uh, a large impact on the, on the maintenance in the future and the conservation of that uh, salt marsh, which is, is a very rare habitat now in this country. But would the effect of a barrage on the tidal flow in the Severn estuary cause a decline? Director of the Marine Station at Dinar in Brittany, Professor Christian Rettier. The, the environmental conditions of the basin are very different from the conditions before the construction. Uh, we, we find now two types of habitats in the Rhone's Basin. We, we find a, 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 an intertidal zone. Uh, the amplitude is approximately six meters and a subtidal zone. And we have more habitats than before. And we can say that the biodiversity of the Basin, biodiversity of habitats, biodiversity of species has increased. The biodiversity is higher than before because some species living, living in subtidal habitat in the sea pass through the barrage and go to the Basin. The Severn Barrage has been the subject of debate for many years. But now, with the world's resources in rapid decline, many are saying we cannot afford not to make the Severn Estuary work for our energy needs. But others think the price will be too high to pay, with the environmental changes a 10-mile wall across these waters will bring. In France, both nature and the human population appear to have adapted to the barrage across the estuary of the River Rance. But that was a prototype for a bigger barrage across the Mont Saint-Michel Bay, and it might be interesting to note to some that that has not materialised.